All right, so clearly you're trained in sword and shield. I may be looking to change that, my friend. Oh my god, that is so large. What the hell is that? I I love it. I am in love with that weapon. It's so low tier as well, but it looks this good. What? Uh, do we have more than one of these, or is this equipped on... No, we do have more than one. But this jagged battle axe... Oh my god, all the two handed weapons are just massive. Batman has gotten angry. Or just very, very metal. Ah, uh, uh... Well, let's see if you have any points in weapon and shield. And if not, maybe I'll be looking into making you the two handed. It's kind of funny when the, the the lady is the tank and the uh and the big scary man boy turns out to be the damage dealer. No, no, no. He came with sword and shield. We should we should respect his decisions. Unfortunately, plus he probably looked really badass with the tower ship. Why does? Oh my god! I was about to complain about the old Dragon Age thing of shields always float off the back for some reason, but finally. This game is the first one to sort of have it make sense with straps, even though it is still not obeying the laws of gravity. But at least it's a little better. That's just the most rigid leather we have ever seen known to man, etc, etc. Do you have any decent blade that you can have? No, that's a terrible blade, but it's gotta happen. So we now have two tanks in the party. This is gonna be weird. One-handed, but yeah, we only have that mercenary lord blade. Fuck me, I should not have been selling literally everything. I didn't expect to get another tank out of nowhere, though. Griffin helmet. Oh, dude, that's really nice. Yeah, you a badass, my friend. You a big old badass. Let's see what we got over here. Did you actually drop anything decent? I think that's already a better one-handed <laughs> than what you were using, my friend. Dear God, what are the wardens doing? Ever since Ferian disappeared, no one gets anything decent. There you go. Doesn't suit you in the slightest, but it's gotta be done, right? Alright, how much have we got around here? We got that little landmark that I have already, well, marked. Anything that I haven't looted yet? Why am I playing as Blackwall almost exclusively now? No, I am not Blackwall, as much as I wish I was. Cotton and yet another Raider Axe, we don't really need more than one. Oh, Mosaic Piece, oh yeah. Was there a reason that you were here, buddy? Or... Did you just end up here because you were protecting those peasants? Because, I mean, this isn't where they were from. You told them to go back home and they ran the fuck away, so... What is in here? Not a whole lot of note by the looks of things. Nothing to- Ah, oh, I was about to say nothing to read and here it is! The Elysian Empire. I don't know about the Elysian Empire. Although probably not as much as that book would have told me. But oh well. Maybe I'll read it eventually anyway. I just- I, I don't have time for reading. The session's nearly over! This time goes so damn quick when I'm playing this game. Because we got so much to cover, but I feel like this is the first uh, session in quite some time. When I feel like I've made massive amounts of progress. The Inquisition got a hell of a lot stronger this time. We almost finished up the Hinterlands. And well, I think I'm about to go ahead and stop the Carter operating in the Hinterlands as well. Blood Lotus! Yes, please. Thank you. And then we'll go ahead and get that book for Vivienne at some point as well. I should also maybe go back to Haven, just so I can talk to, um, Blackwall and get his personal quest and everything. And I guarantee you he's gonna have one. Jesus, this where the card is hanging out? It's behind this massive ass waterfall? Or is this maybe that waterfall we were told about ages ago that's probably got a load of cool shit in it? Please, oh god, have a load of cool shit in it. I would like some cool shit. Thank you. Now I can already see a billion enemies just waiting for us at the entrance. Don't know how we're gonna get into that one. Let me, uh, let me take a quick sweep of the area. It's gonna be- oh shit, I thought that was a ton of enemies ca charging towards me. But no, it's just my boys. Hmm. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's a very angry man that also happens to be a bear. Go invisible. There we go. I don't think we're gonna have time to take on the Carter here, but I do want to have a little look around. Jesus, you're tough. I want to see what level you are, but it never shows up for- Ow. For Darwin. Oh. Oh yeah, we got no heals. Sorry, not heals. We got no sort of support magic as you, do we? Solus is sort of a, a necessary constant in my team. And I very much forgot about that. Wait, why is Varric here? I meant to bring Cassandra! I have made a very big mistake. There is no way we're going to be able to kill a single bear. You're a great warden, you ended the blight! 
And we're all dead. We all died. That was horrible. You had a brother. I did. Oh, okay, I here we go. Miss him sometimes. Man, I party chat has really common with Black Wolf. Sister. She died when I was very little. I'm sorry. Oh. I often think about what she'd be like now, had she lived. Much like her brother, I would expect. Make her and what is that like? We know nothing head. about you. All this hair. <laughs> I mean, it's better than what happened to Vivienne, right? I was expecting her to be so attractive, and I don't, I don't know, not into bald girls, I guess, but whatever. Although, she has a skin from Skunk and Anansi, Anansi vibe, and uh, I can dig that. I can absolutely dig that. No one's gonna know what that is, are they? That's a really fucking obscure band that I love, but whatever. I'm going to murder you now, please. Oh god, I kinda wanna play as Blackwall and see what I can do as him. I, gave, I forgot to give him abilities last time I went into combat, so that is mostly why he was absolutely pathetic. So, I want to see what weapon and sh- Oh my god! That was huge! And that is just slapping someone with your damn shield. And it does that much? Yeah. Yeah, he a damn good tank. I'm glad I kept him with the shield. I think it just makes more sense. It's sort of just the way you imagine a Grey Warden to be. It's Duncan style, it's Alistair style. And sometimes that's just, you know, it's what you need. Firion was an outlier in the fact that he was this badass fucking jewel dagger shanky shanky boy. Uh, he, that's not really the archetype of a Grey Warden at all. It's not what they're trained to be. He just happened to be a god with a, uh, with his double daggers. Why have I been invisible for so long? It lasts forever, doesn't it? It's good shit. It's good shit. And I'm hoping what the game's gonna do is it's gonna do like a three of each uh, style like it did in... I was about to say in 2, but it didn't. It did absolutely not do that in 2, because you had more warriors to drive in 2. Aveline and Fenris, and that was it. I think you only had 3 mages, because then you had rogues, you had Isabella and Varric. Yeah, so it was like 2 of each, and then sometimes your sister would show up <laughs> in 2 anyway, or at least in the uh, in the version I got. So that, that was the third mage that was throwing me off. Look at you! You're unique! Got ourselves a ginger goat and I'm gonna chase him to the ends of the earth. He must be worth something! Oh, we got no one that's ranged. I mean, you're technically ranged? Yes, let's send a noble out hunting. Lord Wolsey! Wolsey! Th this goat is a noble! What do we do? Alright, I got to get him. We have to do this. Is it all going towards him? Oh my god, we did it! What have we done? Oh my god! What is this bullshit? He's huge! I mean, I don't think rage demons are- but the ones we see are not normally that large, are we? It's absolutely the biggest one we've ever seen, but oh my god, she does the most damage out of anyone I've ever seen. It's gonna be easy! She can also paralyze- yeah. Yeah, I'm very glad we got a destructive mage on our team now. Ugh, oh, and this double tank thing. I think it can work. They're taking, like, no damage. Ignore Blackwall's missing limbs there, but mostly, they're taking no damage. Sorry about that, Lord Wolseley. What the hell are you? And explains his little ginger tinge, I guess. Ooh. There's a dude down here? Avar Blade Valley. And by a dude, I mean an angry bear and probably a note that we can read. How interesting. I'm invisible, you can't do shit. I'm invisible, you can't do shit. I'm invisible, you can't do shit. Let me read, thank you. And let it found on a corpse. She told us right and proper, son. Three times round the crown statue. Right and close enough to brush the stone itself. And the spirits will listen. Everything else has been done. We slipped a silver to the Chantry to save a grand save grandfather's body from the burning. And he's buried close by. Three times round. Always turn him right. And the spirits will bring him back to us. Go now. And don't be afraid. Why is it so silent when all my friends are being slaughtered two inches away from me? Excuse me? Also, am I meant to listen to what that's saying and then actually do the three times round or whatever the hell? Bring the grandfather back. This is not okay. At the very least, I will claim this landmark as my own, which is probably not the most tactful thing to do in this particular situation. Why are you going for the fennec? What is going on? Leave that bear alone! Yep, he literally did just shank the fennec. Disengage, dammit. Unless he's already here, in which case, oh fuck. Uh, claim? 
Thank you. At last. There you go. Saga of Trita, Bright Axe, Avar Mother yet again. And I think we might have found where the Avars lay resting. I don't know if the grandfather was supposed to be an Avar, but I don't think the Avars have existed for a very long time in canon, right? So... So what? Also, what the hell is this? Oh, it's more Crystal Grace? Maybe it's not as rare as I thought. But either way, it still looks amazing. I want all of it. Oh, we're connecting up, uh... The Grand Forest Villa to wherever the hell we are right now. Nice! So, I really need to read those instructions again, please. What's this quest called? I don't even know. Three times around the crown statue. Right hand, close enough to brush the stone itself. And the spirits will listen. So, doing so... Crown statue? I guess you're crowned. Come on, come on, come on, come on, don't piss off the bear, don't piss off the bear, don't piss off the bear, don't piss off the bear. Really hard to do this. Oh god, are we pissed off the bear? Now we can't bring back the old man. Right, I'm gonna- Ow? Ow, that actually got you? How? You were nowhere close. Oh, whatever. Yeah, we don't do very much damage. That's a bear. They don't take ice damage, damn it. Come on, come on, come on. We can, however, potentially paralyze. We started doing more and more damage. Oh yeah, I forgot we just call a storm to wherever the hell we are. God, I love that so much. And which one is chain lightning? Was that chain lightning? The one that barely does anything? I guess because it has nothing to chain to, unfortunately. What's this one? Oh, that's static cage. Oh, we have to. Oh, that is so cool. Yeah, yeah. Storm magic is the coolest shit we have seen in the game so far. I'm so glad we have Vivian. Wow. We just need more elements now to make her actually half decent. Now, since I imagine the grandfather is probably going to be some kind of horrific manifestation of pain and suffering, uh, I'm gonna save first. I don't trust this at all. All right, so. I think that's one. It's really hard to control this. That should be two. That should, oh God, it's here. Is he a bear? What kind of monstrosity are you? No, it's just a rotting old man. Okay. Why did we bring him back? Why did we go through with this mess? <laughs> what kind of choice was this? And why have you come back in this gross little state? I mean, you have a nice weapon for sure, but I think that's all the good that can be said about you, my friend. Uh, let's drown you in explosive fucking... Lightning, shall we? There we go. I forgot what element I was actually using. Bye bye. And did you just ram him through the statue? Impressive, Darwin. Uh, give me everything you own. Thank you, old man. And we got level three influence. We're doing all right. It's just a belt of spirit resistance. Why did we do this? They could have made that at least vaguely interesting, right? Oh, that's the new corpse. That's what the undead looks like. I never want to face another one of those. It's just a slightly deformed naked guy. We see those pretty much wherever the hell we go anyway, especially with Sarah around. Ugh. All right, guys. I think that may be where I have to leave it for now. But we genuinely did accomplish shitloads, and it feels really, really good. I think the game, it's not beginning to hit its stride in terms of it, it's at its peak right now, but I'm definitely enjoying it. I'm seeing the progress, I'm seeing where it's going, and I'm enjoying it more than I was last time. I'm disappointed what the hell they've done to the friends of Red Jenny. That's really, 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 really annoying. Because it could have been the coolest thing. It could have been so badass. It was so well built up for the worst payoff ever. It's just Sarah. I like that she's a companion. I like that they brought the Red Jenny, uh, the friends of Red Jenny that close to the story. But in doing so... They made them the most boring, needless faction in the world, purely as fan service, I imagine, for the people who were theorizing, and they just did it badly, and it, 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 it doesn't feel very Bioware at all. But oh well. Other than that, I really like Blackwall, I really like, I, I loved going to Orle and everything. We're finally hitting that political intrigue, that badassery. We've got some cool spells, cool abilities. Darwin isn't completely useless anymore, and I'm liking it. And I hope you guys are too. If you are, please do like, subscribe, share, comment, all that amazing stuff. It really does help out both me and the channel. And hopefully next time my allergies won't be destroying me as much. Because I need to go and sneeze 
my fucking asshole out, and I, I, I really, you guys don't need to see that. So for now, this is Strike signing off, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye!